Welcome to Looking Hollywood, the only show that gives you a step-by-step breakdown to the world of celebrity fashion and beauty. By the time we are through, you will be the one looking red carpet ready. Every day, we take you inside our Los Angeles headquarters. It's an exclusive behind-the-scenes look with celebrity stylists, makeup artists, and industry insiders. Best of all, everything you see on the show can be found at lookinghollywood.com or by downloading our I Want It app at iTunes. It ain't for everybody. Uh, Welcome to Hollywood, baby. Picture. Uh-huh. Tell me with. Let's not even talk about it. Let's do it. You're blinded by the action. You need that. Today on Looking Hollywood, we're going to pick out our It Girl of the Week. Who will it be? Jessica Alba, Blake Lively, or Kim Kardashian? Cover the latest styles and trends and look at Angelina Jolie, Jennifer Aniston, and Eva Mendez with our experts. And we are going to give away $50,000 in great products from our sponsors, as well as cover beauty secrets, the perfect ponytail, and lots of celebrity fashion without breaking the bank. All this and much more today on Looking Hollywood. Joining us in our media lounge, our celebrity makeup artist, Collier Strong, wardrobe stylist Maria Devaris and hairstylist Mitch Stone. Thanks for being here, you guys. First couple of ladies we've got, an unlikely pair, you might say, Jen and Angie. What do you think? This is a great example of two beautiful women with polar opposite styles. Jennifer, very relaxed, very casual, beautiful girl next door. Angie, a very elegant um, style to her, regardless of whether her hair is tossed up or thrown back. And I've worked with Angie before, and what I was blown away by is that face, the face of an angel. She like leaves you breathless. I mean, she's a philanthropist, a mother, and, and a woman of the world, and she really plays down the fact that she has this exquisite face in her styling. And both girls, you notice, with both dresses, they're both elegant, sophisticated dresses, but their mm -hmm. hair is both just kind of simple. It's mm -hmm. not too over the top. But I did notice that Jennifer Aniston, in a lot of the different looks that we've seen her in, she does sort of keep that same style. She's very consistent with it. Well, this dress is very Grecian, is very elegant, all the beading, and, and it could go really sophisticated quickly. And so by keeping her hair and her makeup downplayed, it's a perfect balance. Yeah. She's very elegant, simple, very comfortable in her own skin on the red carpet. Well, obviously both of them are, right? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> uh, this is uh, Jen in a nice ponytail, and um, I'm gonna head over to the beauty lab, and I'm gonna show you how to get a ponytail like this. Hey guys, let me show you a few tips so you guys can rock it just like Blake and Jen. Take a little Paul Mitchell worked up spray, or any kind of hairspray or mousse, and just kind of get it right at the root. I just lift it up, and this will really just give it a nice textured look. Just get your blow dryer and you don't really need to worry about doing anything too much. Only use your fingers. And just get in there and lift it. Kind of dry it to give it the body you want and the texture. So now you can see you've already got a great amount of volume and some texture and you're ready for a pony. And I like to pull it straight up from the sides. It just brings up your cheekbones and it's a strong look. No matter what kind of ponytail you're looking for. <clears throat> These are the ponytail holders I like. They're great, they're a bungee cord. It fits exactly to your hair. So whether you have thick hair, thin hair, you just hook it around the hair, and then you just hook it right in, and boom, you're done. Quick, simple, and there you go. Good? Great. With the help of our fashion and beauty teams, we have today's It Girls. Let's take a look <laughs> at Blake Lively over here. Hello. <laughs> this is my girl. Blake. This is my girl, Blake Lively. She uh, is. You live for her. I live for her because I just think that she is young Hollywood. She typifies it. Here she is in this gorgeous Marquesa gown, and she looks spectacular. She looks like young women want to look. She's having exactly. fun she with it. Exactly. She has no accessories. Her hair is pulled back. So simple and chic. Bright color. It's all about the dress and the silhouette. And yeah. her natural beauty is shining through. Maria, show us your fashion breakdown. I want to see how to get the look. Blake is wearing this exquisite Marquesa gown. We have found the most amazing dress from modcloth.com for $109. And then we've added 
this fabulous bracelet from Forever 21, bearing a striking resemblance to the fabulous Louboutins, are these wonderful suede pumps from gojane.com. And this whole look, $162.50. That's all the time we have, but if you are looking for more tips, want to know where to get Blake Lively's shoes or Jessica's favorite lip gloss, then download the I Want It app at iTunes or log on to lookinghollywood.com. There you will see the fashion breakdown and beauty blueprint from today's show. And here's a sneak peek at our upcoming backstage edition of Looking Hollywood. We have celebrity fitness trainer Ron Matthews giving us his workout tip to training your core. Professional makeup from L'Oreal for under $20 with our makeup expert Collier Strong. An in-depth look at celebrity search using the latest technology, Dan Tappert. All this and more on the backstage edition of Looking Hollywood.